girl Voriqua in action and I'm coming to you with an introduction of my numero uno video of my weight loss journey so stay tuned all right so basically this video will be an introduction like I said of my weight loss journey um, I'm gonna let you know about you know all about me about my weight my struggles and all that so basically as a child as a child, I always been overweight or not overweight, but kind of like on the heavy side. Um, a memory I have um, is when I was about, I want to say 11 or 12, um, stepping on the scale, my cousin being there with me and, she, and everybody was just staring at the scale with, waiting to see what the number will say. And I remember the number was either like 196 or 198. My cousin was like, wow, of course, I was in the sixth grade. I was around 11 or 12, so that's a lot. My aunt was like, that's a lot. So, yeah. But I don't know. For some reason, I didn't pay no mind to it. It didn't affect me. I don't know. Um, of course, of course, I've always been um, a tall girl. So, you know, I am 5'9". So, but anyways, um, I remember, you know, and and this still happened now and day to a, this still happens now and day to a lot of kids um they get bullied because of their weight and i was i was one of those that you know used to get called miss piggy or fat or a lot of you know names that you know make me feel so insecure and instead of helping i would just eat i would just eat i don't know without thinking but anyways um, as I got to high school, um, I, I don't know if you have done this, I mean, or, I mean, have you ever heard of the, about this, but I, um, decided to, I don't know, I, I became the class clown kind of style, so that kind of helped me kind of fade it, what was going on in me, or not see what was going on with my body. Uh, of course, I didn't felt it as pretty as... Pretty as the other girls are attractive. I, of course, I never had a boyfriend in high school or whatever. But anyways, I never felt that attractive or anything like that. And being a clown helped me, I guess, get through the high school years. Um, I don't know. That was my shield. My shield. <laughs> but anyways, um, as time went by, I remember getting older, having my first child. And after my first child was, I don't know, I want to say four, five, six months I decided one night to step on the scale because I know that I was eating a lot and I was eating usually at crazy times, 12, one o'clock in the morning, two o'clock in the morning. And I decided to step on the scale. And that day I remember seeing the scale says, said at that time, 298 pounds. At that moment, I remember just feeling so disgusting with myself and crying you know, why did I had let myself go that far? Um, the only thing, you know, I could have just thought about, okay, I need to, I don't know, do something about it. But the only thing I did about it, which I didn't, did any drastic diets or anything, I just stopped eating late. Stop eating late and be a little bit more conscious. When I did that, I went from 298 to 268 around there. And... You know, I remember at 298 also, my 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 highest, like, size in jeans were size 24. I was like, wow. But, um, yeah, like I, was, uh, like I said, after that, I kept my weight at 268. You know, I I was not doing any, any, you know, any diets or anything like that. But then after that, I remember, um joining Weight Watchers, that was about six years ago. I started my journey in Weight Watchers at 268. Um, and then I ended up at 217, uh, which I'll post a picture right there for you. I can see how I looked at 217. Then, um, and I did that of course, because I was going on vacation with my husband, a friend of mine's and, I, I, you know, I wanted to look good when I went to Puerto Rico, but I was not thinking about completing this. And, um, you know, as I let, I stopped doing Weight Watchers, I slowly gained my weight. And um, 
I have tried um, in the past, you know, after that I tried um, trying to lose weight, but I only lost like 10, 15, and then I'm done. I quit because I felt that I could did enough and I'm, I'm back. I don't know. I think I missed my cheap, my, my weight or I don't know, but I, I, I just quit all the time. And then now, of course, um, I started this weight loss journey in May 1st. And um, I had a few bumps, so it hasn't been perfect. It's been like, you know, good and then three weeks down the hill and then good. And now is that I've been a little bit more constant. Yes, I have my still my ups and downs in this um, journey. So I started this time in May with 264.8. Now that of course I waited myself today, I can show you that I am at 240.4. So, um, my goal is to hit 180. I do not care how long it takes. Okay. I don't really care. Um, and the way I'm intending to do that as I've been trying, you know, and like I said, I, like I said in my last, um, video, I will have my ups and downs. So basically, you know, it's going to be more like, I am going to go to the gym most likely four to five times a week and then um, I'm going to try my best to eat healthy and that's what I've been trying to do. And another thing I've been trying to do is basically um, meal prep. I mean, so far, I mean, it's my first week. I can't tell you it's, it's perfect or whatever, but you know, I am planning to, you know, do that more often especially now that i started working i want to be able to make sure that i have my meals my meal preps in the freezer to go that way i'm not worrying about cheating or feeling hungry or anything like that so yeah so um like i said i'm at 240.4 and i'm taking this journey not yeah, like slow and steady. You know, I don't want to lose weight crazy fast. I just want to be healthy. So thanks for watching. I will be posting my, my weight loss journey every Monday. And I look like this and I'm sorry for my appearance, but it's late. It's about 10 o'clock at night, but everybody's sleeping. And as, as you know, if you watched my last video, I have four kids and a husband and was best if you know the best time i guess to record is when my kids are sleeping or they're not home or the house is quiet that's what's happening right now so um for those of you who hasn't subscribed please subscribe to my channel and keep on watching because this will help me to keep myself accountable by making videos and of course getting getting that encouragement from ya i do need the support from ya i really need it i want to know what it you know, I want to see what I will look at 180 that, you know, I never been thin. So I want to see that and I want you to see it with me. So hasta luego. Bye.